It's Isaac here, back with another video, and in today's video, I will be discussing seasons versus events. Now, if you're an older player, or if you've formed your account in like 2019, then you probably know what an event is. However, if you do not, then this is the video to learn. Even if you already know what an event in a season is, I still encourage you to watch this video, because I will also be debating which was better, in my opinion. So before we get started, it'd be great if you could like and subscribe. Maybe share this channel with your friends. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Oh yeah, make sure to comment down below telling me your opinion of this video. I also can't think of a lot of good content ideas. So it'd be great if you could tell me some ideas for videos. Because, you know, I need your feedback. I can't just make everything up myself. Let's get into the video. So as you can see, I'm on NitroTech Wiki today. I use this site quite a bit. I don't know what NitroTech Wiki is. I will be leaving a link to that in the description. It is like... A website where you learn everything like it has everything about NitroType. Anything you would ever want to know is on, about NitroType is here. So first let's start with what we all know and love, seasons. So seasons are one to three month long periods to which racers are awarded cash titles, ca cash and cars for ranking up which can be done by completing races. However this is not what seasons were always like. If you go down here, seasons you used to not earn cars or titles or achievements. The only people that got cars or achievements was the people that got first, second, or third on the leaderboard. And that's here. First place, champion, 10 million. Second place, rival, 5 million. Third place, challenger, 2 million. Fourth to 10th, competitor, 500,000. 11 to 50th, contestant, 250,000. I have never gotten any of these. The highest I have ever placed in a season, I think is this season. Uh, for the first few minutes of season 22, I was like 36, and that was only was held for like a few minutes. And then teams, top teams, also got money and titles for their members. And then in season 21, they started rewarding cars. So season 21, you got these two cars for racing, and there were also achievements for things such as uh, like sessioning, do using nitros. A while ago, you didn't get eliminated nitros, you actually had to earn them from racing. Season 22, that was kind of like a summer themed season. I really like that season. Uh, I wish they had a summer event though. Season 23 was the back to school event, which we will be covering in a second. Season 24, you could get these three cars, kind of Halloween themed. Season 29 was the Christmas season. First Christmas season that was not an event. It was very disappointing for me. But I liked this car, this car, this car, this... I got this car, this car, that car, and that car, and that car. Season 26 is kind of like Valentine's slash New Year's. Season 27 is Vaporwave slash Technology. Season 28 is Wampus World. And season 29 is a whole mess of things. We have some Halloween, space, kind of sporty cars, and back to school. So... So... Yeah, and that's Seasons. Uh, let's see. So if we go to Events. So Events are kind of hard to explain. Yeah, Events are really hard to explain for someone who doesn't know what an event is. So basically think of it as a season, but like an upgraded season. So in Events, they normally lasted from anywhere from one to two months, like kind of like a season. However, you didn't just get, you you got them in the achievements. There was no season page at that time, so you got everything in the achievements. There were a few themes, and they, they did events back when you didn't get cars every season. They did events back when you only got cars from the dealership, achievements, or events. They, this was when seasons were still just competitions on the leaderboard. So they had a few main ones. They had X-Max, Summer, Halloween, Back to School, Spring, and Pack. Uh, I participated in X-Max 2018. I missed Summer 2018. I wasn't a serious enough player. Oh, and there, oh, I, I missed the Halloween season by a few months. I did Back to School. I think I did both Back to Schools. I didn't get all the cars, though. Uh, no, I got all of them from Back to School, except for the Underachiever. I did the spring season, not spring season, spring event, but I didn't do a lot of races. I just barely formed my account at that time. 
and pack I missed out on. I was I existed, but I didn't do anything. So some X Max, you have the, the Slay, the X Max tree, the Shadow X Max tree, and the Party Slay. That that is a really good car, the Party Slay. Summer event, I missed summer event. Summer events were really cool. Halloween events, more Christmas event. You can see the theme is kind of like buggies, like old cars. Summer, most of these are reskins, I think. Yeah, reskins. Halloween, same car. X Max, this is where X Max starts to become really prominent and special. They start getting a lot of cars. Summer event, that was a cool summer event. I missed that. 20 of it, 15. That, that was cool. I like both of these cars. I really, really like this car in particular. That one. All of these are good cars. Uh, this was, this is a good car and this is a good car. And this one's an okay car. I like all of these. Hollow Wampus 2016, both very good cars. 2016 X Max, there was a boatload of cars in which that one and that one were my favorite. I didn't, like I said, I didn't make my account until early 2018. Except 2017. Oh, uh, these are okay cars. I think this was a bit of a disappointing one. 2017. This was kind of when Hollow Wampus rose to its prominence. This is when it was in its full glory. This was also the last Hollow Wampus event. Kind of sad. 2017, there was an absolute boatload of cars. 2018, I got this car. I really like all the rest of them. Pack, there was two cars. Uh, I didn't get either one of those. I know people that did. 2018, this was a pretty good one. I like that car, I like that car, and that one, and that one. Back to School 2018, same cars as Back to School 2019, except for a few new ones here. And this one didn't wasn't included. 2018 X Max, I got this one, this one, this one, this one. No, I didn't get that one. That one, that one, that one, that one. And yeah. In 2018, I wasn't too active. I did anywhere from 10 to 40 races a day. Back to School... I got every car except for that one because I didn't want to blow 10, no, was it 10 or 15 million dollars on that car? And that's, I just don't like that. Um, yeah, so events, like I said, events, you can get a lot more cars. You actually could get achievements for using nitros. You could get ones for sessions. It was just really fun. It was also really hard, which might have been why they, well, not hard, but for a lot of players, it was hard, which might be why they took it out. But if we go to my account... What? No, I. Never mind. I already said which cars I had, so that doesn't really. Yeah. So, let's see. So now let's count how many events there were. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one. Okay, so there was twenty-one events. That's a lot of events. Uh, oh, and another thing. So now we're going to like say my opinion. I liked events more than seasons. That's kind of a common fact with most players. If you've been around for events, you'll know that they were really cool. Uh, that was kind of like the one thing everyone looked forward to was events. But unfortunately, they took those out because seasons, people, for some reason, newer players like seasons more. And I kind of, so as you know, they made this season three months long because there's going to be an X-Max season. Uh, however, because there is going to be an X-Max season, if you if anyone watching has any sort of connections to Nitro Type, which I, I extremely highly doubt that, but I would really like it if this X-Max season was completely X-Max themed, so I don't want it to be like half and half, like season 29. I'd like it to be like completely X-Max. I'd also like there to be a lot of cars, maybe even change the track to like a winter theme. Uh, yeah, I, I have high expectations. I always love X Max. X Max, I kind of like all the events, but I think if I had to rank them, my favorite event is X Max, followed very closely by Summer and Hollow Wampus, followed closely by Spring, Back to School, and Pack. Uh, yeah, I think that's everything in today's video, so thank you all for watching. I will make sure to put the link for Nitro Type Wiki in the description below. I don't know if there's an age requirement to get on this, but I would just be careful. As always with any website, just be safe. And yeah, that's it for today's video. So make sure to like, subscribe, share this with your friends, comment down below, and have a wonderful day.